Hello everybody and welcome, and this is probably going to be my last Modern Warfare 2 game uh, before Black Ops. At the moment I'm really into Medal of Honor, and if anyone has Medal of Honor and they would like to play, just PM me, because I'm looking for people to play with. And also if anyone's having a problem with the game freezing and you have to do a hard reset, uh, please let me know because uh, I thought I found a driver fix for it, but uh, as I uh, was testing it yesterday, it froze me twice again, which is uh, kind of pissed me off. So a couple of things I want to uh, basically bring up in this is uh, this is actually a game of free for all. I was playing with uh, SF3 Itard, who uh, in his right should have won this, but was trying to get a uh, a 360 no scope for the game winning kill, uh, which allowed me to nab the win. So uh, thank you very much, Itard. And this was meant to be dual commentary, but uh, unfortunately I just haven't got the time. So as you see, I'm using my uh, favorite gun, the Tar 21, with a silencer, and uh, it's just a pity that this isn't going to be in Black Ops. But uh, hey, what can you do? So uh I've just done a um Turtle Beach X forty one uh, conversion kit as you uh it's probably up by now, it's rendering as I'm doing this video. And I've also bought a a PVR, so uh, I'm gonna see if I can get the PVR to actually record my gameplay. And if that will do it then you will have Medal of Honor and Black Ops gameplay. Uh I know um like uh Pembus from Today's Warfare was telling me about not today's warfare for sorry, um Oh my god, what's it called? Uh, Pembus, <laughs> sorry about this. Um, Pembus and Tiffmeister, what's their PC Warfare? And uh, he said there's a console and he can show me how to use it, but uh, look, I have this kit now, and if it's going to work, then that's all the better because uh, at least then I can stop recording, play record, and do all bits and bobs. So basically, I'm after purchasing that. I've got conversion kits too, so I can use it on the laptop, and I'm going to. Uh, that's due. It was due today, but maybe it'll come tomorrow or the next day. I've got all the other bits and bobs, and. Uh, Hopefully I will be able to get that working. And what I want to do is, um, Medal of Honor is a very, if you will, realistic. So it's kind of a campy, slow game. Now, for example, I don't snipe in this game, but I love to snipe in um, Medal of Honor. And the thing is, you can snipe from huge distances, and you can get like a headshot, and you get thousands of points for it, and mad kill streaks. And it's really, really nice to play it that way. And the thing is that no one complains about you camping because, like in real life, if you're a sniper, you're not going to be quick scoping. You're going to be as far away as possible sniping you know the other enemy team and the other enemy team snipers are going to be sniping you so that's how the game works and that's really why I like it there's no bullshit you know people complaining you just if you get shot it's like damn I hate that sniper I'm gonna find him and that's how it works but it is annoying however when your whole flipping team is sniping and you're like come on I just need like one more kill someone someone move forward capture the point so we can move on to the next area you know so what I want to do is I want to try and uh, test record with the PVR and try and get loads of little clips and then for example I will show you how to play the game as a sniper and the examples of the kind of kills you can get I want to get uh, examples of the rifleman class and how you play the rifleman class best uh, and then how you play the um, special ops or you kind of say the SMG class uh, best so I want to do a video on that and then I want to do a video on the uh, the team deathmatch aspect of the game. Um, in that, I don't use the snipers at all. I just use the uh, rifleman's class or the special ops class. And what I want to basically do is go through that with you guys and show you my favorite positions where I like to go, where I can spawn and kill people eff efficiently, and all that kind of stuff. So I want to get them out of the way. So hopefully, I'll get the PVR working and I'll do a, a video on the PVR and how that works. Secondly, is I've got the Minecraft mod working. Um, I ended up I got a, a new mod excuse me a belch I got a new mod and then combined the original mod I had and that mod together which uh, seemed to work for me so I have the whitelist and all that working again so what I want to do is I want to try and launch that on some night um, stick by on the twitter on the toolbar I'll update it there and I'll let you guys know when it's going to be launched and uh, for the time the date etc at the moment I'm really busy on college and uh, I want to, you know, get a couple of uh, these videos out of the way before Black Ops comes out and all that jazz. So uh, I think that's really it. Uh, I went through the headset, and I went through Minecraft, I went through Black Ops, um, the PVR. <laughs> I have no money for it anyway. It's on the credit card, so uh, you never know. Maybe I'll get some money for Christmas and uh, and uh, get rid of that. So that's the story. Um, so about this game, uh, it's quite enjoyable actually. It was uh, a free for all. Myself and I were actually talking over Skype. Now we weren't giving away people's positions, but we were just uh, chatting away. And uh, 
as you see it's a tie at the moment and uh, I'm just looking for people so so far the things are looking quite good for uh, Black Ops I'm hoping now when Black Ops comes out that everyone's not going to leave uh, everybody is not going to leave Medal of Honor because uh, really as you splash man didn't want to buy it and I said I'll go on you can get it he found it for I found it for 20 euro on eBay he found it for 15 and it's exactly the same so um, for 15 euro you're getting a pretty decent game and he's addicted to it and me too I've played that game something like 28 29 hours in the first few days since I've bought it and I think I've played overall something like 200 hours on modern uh, modern warfare so uh, I'm not even 200 hours I've played. Steam says 200 hours, but that's I think how long Steam has been on. I'm not sure. I can't remember, but uh, so my 200 hours is all I've played on Modern War or Warfare 2. So um, that's what that's to show you just what I think of uh, of Medal of Honor. So uh, like I said, if anyone has that same problem, let me know. And uh, if you want to play with me, uh, please because it's it's great fun, especially when you're on the opposite teams. Like uh, myself and Splash, it doesn't always put you on the same team. And uh, it doesn't let you can switch teams, but only when there's a, when they're unbalanced. So uh, it's quite fun being against each other. So now you can see in this game, I need two more kills, and Nightard needs one more kill. Yeah. And um, I'm not sure if you can hear him in the background, but I'm pretty sure about now he's gonna say he's trying to get a 360 no scope. So uh, and I'm just running frantically trying to find someone, and for the life of me, I can't find anybody. So uh, there, I eventually <laughs> I kill him there, and uh, I finish the game. So uh, this will probably be my last commentary. I do have one more left, which is uh, a free for all with Splashman against Boosters, but uh, it's not uh, it's not a great gameplay. So uh, I don't know if you want me to put that up with a commentary. Let me know. It only takes a, a few minutes to do these commentaries. So uh, thirty and six for free for all. I think that's pretty good, and uh, I'm looking forward to Black Ops.